Last week we give thanks, today we give props. So we are looking at props in primetime games, specifically Thursday night football, Cowboys, Seahawks. There's a few to go through here. We got the Dallas team total at 27 and a half. Dak touchdown passes over one and a half at minus 230. Dak interceptions at 0.5 or a half. Dak MVP at plus 700. He is now fourth in the race. All right, let's start with the team total. Hard to not go over. They've gone over in all four or all five home games so far, but they've beaten up on bad teams. I'm not sure Seattle, they're not a good team, but I'm not sure they fit the the standard, the low standard of a good team or a bad team that's that uh, Dallas has faced all all season at home. I, I would not play the over. It's a little juicy at 28 and a half. It's less juicy. Obviously, four touchdowns is 28. I wouldn't get involved. I think like Pete Carroll's going to want to not get into a shootout, maybe muck up the game. And that secondary is capable of a turnover here and there. So I would probably pause on the uh, over trend for team totals, Dallas at home this season, but I couldn't fault anyone. They've been sort of reaching another gear lately. Yeah, for sure. Now, next up, Dak touchdown passes over one and a half. It's tempting. It's tempting because he's been great. I just think the juice is too high, right? And you're looking at like a 70% sort of uh, break-even point for that minus 230 money line. I would say no because they they want to run the ball at times around the goal line, and but Dak's been great, and this offense can stretch the field like they showed on Thanksgiving. But I think we're going to see a better performance from Seattle's defense. That game got away from them on Thanksgiving, so it's a little little reluctant to pull the trigger on that. But I couldn't fault anyone. Dak interceptions, will he? Won't he? So this is kind of fun because he had three against the Niners. You take away that Sunday night game uh, on the road where they got smoked. And he's only had three other ones. Remember, at the beginning of the season, he said he would not have 10. I think this, I would bet under here, but that secondary is a ball hawk. Got the rookie as well. I um, I would bet under here. I think that's the right play because I think if they if the game script goes accordingly, they're protecting a lead, they they, they sort of ball control, they're going to run the ball more. I would be, I would play under here. It's, my, it's pick them. It's minus 115 either side. So I do like the under. All right. A clean game for Dak and MVP. So the, the, what, the time to bet him was previous to last weekend. He looked great, and he, to your point, he's now fourth. He shot up the board. I don't think there's value here. There are, There is a path for him to be MVP because the guys who are at the top of the betting board aren't putting up ridiculous stats. Now, their teams are. Jalen Hurts and the Eagles are 10-1. and one. He's the favorite. But Dallas gets Philly at home next week, and but they have to go to Miami. It's almost like Dallas would have to win out for them to – for him to win MVP, and I just think you can get better odds than what it is now currently at plus 700. I think the money line parlay of the remaining games, now granted they can have one loss and still, there's a path there. I just think the value's gone. I would wait to maybe they lose, although I don't think they're going to lose at home to Philly, but maybe I'm wrong. But I think the value's gone on Dak. But it is interesting how much he shot up the board. Yeah, absolutely. I just don't think he's going to get it. No, first. I don't think so either, but... It's almost like his time if he put up the right numbers from here on out and Dallas got a one or a two seed and won the division. Yeah, that's a lot of ask. That's a lot of ask. Okay, well, there you have it. Some props there for Thursday night football. For even more, head to onlyplayers.com right there on the homepage. Doug's got all his bets listed with unit sizes to consider as well and some analysis. 